energy is conserved in chemical reactions. The amount of energy in the universe at the end of a chemical reaction is the same as that before the reaction takes place. If a reaction transfers energy to the surroundings, then the product molecules must have less energy than the reactants by the amount transferred. An exothermic reaction is one that transfers energy to the surroundings, so the temperature of the surroundings increases. Exothermic reactions include combustion, many oxidation reactions and neutralisation. Everyday uses of exothermic reactions include self-heating cans and hand warmers. An endothermic reaction is one that takes in energy from the surroundings, so the temperature of those surroundings decreases. Endothermic reactions include thermal decompositions and the reaction of citric acid and sodium hydrogen carbonate. Some sports injury packs are based on endothermic reactions. Thank <laughs> you.